Um, and I'm very interested in the self-sustaining aspect of it. That's very important. Now you wrote about this, uh, you said that you observed some self-sustaining behavior. For about one quarter of an hour, 10 to 20 minutes. Now what I'm trying to uh, see for myself is how you see the relationship, you have to see the relationship between the electrical energy and what the excess heat output and time, all three parameters together. Can you show me that, those three parameters together? Okay, when we will have a complete data position system, we, of course we will show. In why I have not done a plot together? In order not to create any uh, artificial uh, data. I mean, if you see the uh, data position there, you have actually two DAQ systems. One was for power, one, the other one for uh, temperature. Then you have to put this data together and in, when you put data together from different data acquisition system with different clocks, okay. is, uh, it, you, you must be sure that everything is correctly aligned. Okay, I, I understand that you, okay, you must... Uh, uh, let, me but, let me try a different way. How but, do you know? Because I wasn't there. Okay. I didn't see it. How, How do you know that it was self-sustaining? Because I have taken out the plug from the wall. And with, with uh, taken out the plug from the wall, the system was still producing steam for, for one quarter of an hour. The best way to know that you are not putting in power is to unplug it. You unplug it, and the system is still producing steam for, for one quarter of an hour. It, it, it said in your report all the power was reduced and then switched off. off. Switched off. So, so it, it, the system kept running self sustaining for about five, 15 minutes. Mm -hmm. That's 15 minutes after you reduced it, or 15 minutes after you. Plug, I have. Uh, first we have reduced the power and the system was still going on then we cut the power you, with you pulled it out the yeah and for 15 minutes, minutes the system was going on so uh, I mean also Rossi was a bit nervous and uh, because not because uh, I mean uh, uh, he has told me that when you take out what he calls the drive, then the system can be unstable and uh, you can uh, uh, lose the control on it. But okay, I take my risks and also I'm curious uh, and we cut the power. Well, congratulations to you for taking that risk and not, not having a problem. It's a science. And you do what a scientist must do. Um, okay, I understand now why you why you say. Uh, also, you know, if you cut the power in this way, the, the power meter will switch off, so you don't have the, the data with zero. Uh, you have a picture of it. A small picture. A small picture, but you can find in internet. I have a large picture somewhere, but not here. This power meter has a plug going in and a plug yeah. going in. So, so if you take out the, the, the power... At what time did you cut? Here. Test one. Oh, test one, yeah. Okay. Power reduce, boom. So okay, no, power meter was still on. But, and you still still on because we oh. cut after it and you have here. Wait, 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 here I have larger. Wait, 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 wait. Okay. Clean cut. 13 wait, minutes. Wait, wait. Not one, not one. Okay. Not here. This is about this period. So you can, you can see it. 
because you take out the output of it and so you measure about zero. This it looks like it was running about 10 watts. 10 watts, or is it this so just the control apparatus, or a, a so let me. So did you pull the you pulled the power out here or here? Uh, this is 145. Switch off here, yeah. and you have just the, the the minimum that this apparatus can measure. What time did you pull the plug out of the wall? About. Here. You pulled the plug out at 115, but what? What, why does it say it was running power at for 10 watts? It says it was running power for 10, 10 watts ten, because 10 watts for. Okay, let me remember exactly what. We, this is in series with everything, and there is a main switch here. You switch it off completely, all the, all the system. And then you measure only the, uh, the residual power of, uh, of the control apparatus. But okay. it, it, I mean, this power is I'm, almost, I, is... I'm a little confused. Let's go back. So you said at 115, that's when you pulled the plug out of the wall. Yeah, plug out of... Let us in a clean... Uh, uh, out of the... Yeah, okay. Okay. But this object was still measuring. It is in series. Power comes from here and then goes on. You, uh, you plug it out here and you have a residual 10 watts of his own. Uh, where, where is the residual 10 watts coming from? 10 watts. Let me do a scheme. Here. Control apparatus. Rain. Rain. <laughs> there is rain. I was wondering where I was here. Okay, the... let me correct. I feel like in trial, but it is good. Uh, power meter. Power meter control apparatus is in series. Rossi switch box that actually I have opened it to see that inside there is no batteries and also you can feel it. Cables going to uh, ECAT. Main switch here. If you switch off here, everything will switch off and you. Uh, measure just few watts residual here. Let me see the pen for a second. So, the wall, we call, oh. we call this symbol the wall. Okay. So you say you pull the plug from here, from the wall? You, you, you remove this plug? So when you say that you remove the plug, this is the where the wall from the wall. Did you remove it from the wall? Here. After. And then wait, 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 wait. Where did you where did you remove the plug? Yeah. Between the power meter. Power meter and and the and that object. And the, you and the object. Okay, so you, you didn't actually remove it from the wall. You just Okay. Because this, this residual 10 watts, but this residual 10 watts is almost nothing. Okay, okay. Okay? Okay. All right, I just want to make sure I have, okay. I have to make sure I have my facts. And also I have to remember uh, right. co uh, correctly what uh, anyway, you see that showing a role, actually, you know what a cross check that I was. Stanno finendo. Italians with coffee. <laughs> oh, okay. I, 
I, the power meter is, was always there. But here, there was no power to, to, the, uh, to the system here. And I mean, 10 watts is nothing. Okay, and I'm starting to understand. There's no okay. power razor diagram. Okay. okay. There was no power to, to the ECAT. To the ECAT. Oh, that's why a power meter says 10 watts, but it said it's only... And also... But it's, it, it's, it's 10 watts here, but there's no, there's no power going and, yeah. into the ECAT. There is no power going into the ECAT. And uh, I mean, also, with this measure, here, if you cut here, you can also measure how much power this control box was taking and uh, how much power uh, was going into the cut. So okay. you can take out these 10 watts from here, but is, I mean, you are, we are speaking of 10 watts on, uh, from uh, 1,100. Very small percent. Mm. Very small percent. Well, but it doesn't really matter. One percent of. But you're you're very sure that even this ten watts, you're very sure that there was no connection between the power meter and the control box at that time. I was very sure that there was no power going into the cut. Because you pulled, you disconnected yeah. the wait, wait. Okay. I was very sure that. Uh, and okay, also, I, I was confused yeah. because I see 10 watts going and say, like, how could there be 10 watts? If there, I mean, how but we can, uh, okay, I maybe said, there is no power meter. I, I understand. It's good, it's good. Okay, so that's, that's good. I wanted to know hey, 15 minutes, 15 minutes, no power and steam. And steam. This okay. is a strong, or you, okay, you can, you can have some chemical reaction. But not for 15 minutes. But not for 15 minutes. Okay, good. Okay, good. That's what I'm not. Gonna...